but the bigger the chip got, the smaller the cell size, the more susceptible they became to strange things. Huh. So we had a robot jumping around. <laughs> and the first time the robot was jumping around was because A231 chips were overheating and spitting out wrong answers. Makes sense. The next time it was jumping around was because someone took a picture. Wait, what? If you took a flash photograph, the energy went through the window on the UVE prom and got <laughs> onto the data bus. <laughs> so it didn't erase the prom, but it got out onto the bus. So we called the guys from Intel and, you know, give them a sit down and talking to, because back then Intel was only a uh, half a billion dollar company and we were part of Square D by then and we were a $2 billion company. Yeah. So we'd call them, sit them down and say, hey, you know, your UVE proms are susceptible to flash photographs and bright lights. No. Okay, watch. Click. Go back. 